Yeah, I'm just gonna do quick brows. It smells like down here. Not very good. Yum yum. Whatever, retard. It includes, if you were to rent this, <laughs> if you were to rent this, it includes no doorknobs, but it does have a Lamborghini included with the rent. Hi, big guy. If you can see him back there, he's all the way back there. That's a big cat. But yeah, here's our water situation right now. We've got stolen pipes and they love to do it and not shut the water off of the meter. They just go and rip it out because they're taking off. Just get me falling. Yeah, through. hey, your butt crack's showing. It's got claws, so. Looks a little bit stuck. <laughs> Sound friendly. <laughs> so we're here today to document a recent eviction. Uh, we just evicted this tenant yesterday. We kind of were told. We're gonna kind of go in here, document what's up, and uh, do it live with you guys. Well, it smells pretty good. To tell you that much. Um, so what you're seeing here is uh, what we would call broom clean here at Holden Wise. I don't want to run it out of the room. Mm. Is this where I get mauled by a cat on camera? And that thing looks skinny as fuck. Relax. Hey. This happens a lot. People leave animals in their units. Um, and I told him I was doing it on the weekend because that's when I'm off. Okay, well just please keep in mind that we do need those pictures as soon as possible. Maybe could you take them after work? Sure, let me just bow down to everybody else. And when I have kids, I gotta take care of, and doctors, and everything else. Whatever, retard. Watch your step. Anytime I go into these properties, I always whistle or whatever, just to make sure there's no dogs or anybody in the house that might jump out to get you. But yeah, here's our water situation right now. We've got stolen pipes and they love to do it and not shut the water off of the meter. They just go and rip it out because they're taking off. Looks like she definitely came through and cleaned the unit up after she moved out. I mean, obviously, as you can, obviously see what's going on here. And uh, running away with the copper, so I uh, flooded the whole basement. So typically, when this stuff happens, I mean, this is an older foundation house. There's going to be a lot of dirt on the ground. Um, there might need to be a lot more extensive cleaning by Holton Wise as well, as far as. Um, the dirt, you know, getting, getting taken out, shoveling, probably a crew of guys in a dump truck. Um, you know, it's going to need a new furnace, going to need a new hot water heater. Obviously we know it's going to need new piping. You know, these guys go in here, they steal this stuff and they're watching the house to see what goes back in. If they see us come up with, you know, 10 sticks of copper, which are 10 feet long, they're coming back in this house as soon as you leave to take it all. We're going to start pumping this basement out and, and getting it, getting it uh, back to normal. With the extent of the kind of the mud and dirt on the floor and debris, it's best to basically just, just clean everything and check these drains um, to make sure everything's flowing properly because the amount of stuff that gets in them, you know, now, now it needs a lot more work to, to get it back to, uh, to living standards. Tell James he just earned himself a new pair of flip flops. Sometimes the cats will get back into the units, they'll climb it through like dryer vents or holes in the basement. Who's got the cat food? Yeah, I got it. 
today. Hey, it's got its claws, so. Looks a little bit stuck. Huh? Yeah. Yeah, uh, next couple steps, don't get a cleaning crew in here, clean this all up. Uh, get the electrical all squared away. Electrical box got wet. Looks a little bit stuck. Calm down. So we're going to set this trap. We'll put food in it. We'll come back and check it tomorrow. It's obviously freaking out. We don't want that to happen. Not anything getting hurt. Basically, a lot of times when someone will get evicted, they'll just wreck it in it throw everything, break stuff, so it doesn't get used by anyone else or whatever. Let me get a close-up of this, too. It's like, you'll a lot of times find, like, old clothing, obviously, right? But those are, like, moldy socks. Um, I mean, that's a pretty good way to get hepatitis. So you got to glove up before you come into these units because there's a lot of biohazards. Um, <laughs> look at this sink, man. So this unit obviously has a pest problem. Um, you can see like in the sink here, we've got a, a mouse floating around in what looks to be Campbell's soup uh, in a bath of roaches. Get a close up on that. For the, show the viewers the beauty of this. And the smell is horrendous. Like, in fact, we actually just got new cameras. So if you want, if you click the button in the bottom right corner of your YouTube viewer, it'll turn on the smell of vision and you guys can go ahead and get up close and personal with uh, Tom or Jerry or whatever in there. I don't know how the fuck this works, do you? Uh, no. Should the pants have Oh, like, here we go. I think it's just like this. There we go. Look at this! We got some friskus. Do we just become best friends? So is that back open or no? I think it's a reach your arm all the way in there. Let's take the lid off. That didn't work at all. So I wanna give it away to the cat. Cat just figured it out, it's like <laughs> fuck these guys. Wishing. Wishing. <laughs> Look at that. Look at all of those wishes. There's even a button in there. Hey there, little potty. Oh, hey, how are you? Oh, look at him. Look at him go. Come here. Are you Tom or are you Jerry? I forget which one's which. They, they at least shut off the gas before they pulled the furnace, but if you suspect your house was broken into like this, I would say it's probably a good idea. Uh, shut, shut the gas off at the meter uh, so that, uh, so that, you know, you don't walk into a possible explosion in the house. I found out where the dirt came from. The water level behind you got pretty high. And if you look behind you, there's a crawl space area with, with dirt that just came probably flooding into here. Down those stairs, obviously, is what, what we can tell. Okay. So, um, you know, up in here too. What's up, kitty? Meow, meow. You want to see it? Hi, big guy. If you can see him back there, he's all the way back there. That's a big cat eating some big Cleveland rats. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I know what's happening. So, we'll stick it in the corner. We have a knife. We'll put this right here. It's got moisture in it. If you want, I guess we can cut the top off. Are you really concerned? Here, just give it to me. We'll get that so when we transport the cat to the Vince's house, you know the cat's gonna freak out and spill this water everywhere, right? Yeah, but I mean, we'll go check out the balcony here. We put the pen and just left trash like, everywhere, including the balcony. Um, the good thing about this unit, actually, though, is that it includes. If you were to rent this, <laughs> if you were to rent this, 
It includes no doorknobs, but it does have a Lamborghini included with the rent. Um, that's an amenity provided at no charge. That's definitely a V8, maybe a V10, no doubt in my mind. I think it's ready to go. We should probably take it out for a spin. I'm gonna come back for that. Okay. Well, good thing we came back uh, to find the copper all stolen, because that's always great. And the plumbing fixture stolen. You're gonna spill all the water again in there. I'm just gonna put it right there. It's once the food is, I don't give a shit about the water. All right, so he's locked in this room. He's contained in here. I don't see any ways out. Um, we'll just come back in the morning and uh, hopefully he'll be in the cage and we can uh, take him somewhere that they can take care of him. We'll go check that unit next door too. Hopefully we don't surprise anyone. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.